Не All enemies destroyed. You're victorious. You just crashed into him, but other than that, victorious. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Simple Planes. My name is Weasel, and today it's all about the user creations. I'm gonna, well, try to fit as many of your awesome user creations into this video as I, well, possibly can. And this is for Fasker, for Weasel by Jehasa, and it doesn't really steer. I mean, it's fast in in, in its own way. It's it's doing a thing. Uh, okay, why is it doing? Okay. I mean, it doesn't break, and it's kind of making its way towards the bridge, however it does that. This is fairly impressive, I gotta say. I don't know how it flies. I mean, now it doesn't anymore. Oh, this is an interesting kind of car. Well, the big question is how fast can it go? It's your fastest car. Um, it doesn't go really far because it starts to spin after a hundred feet or so. At least it's rugged. Never mind. This one is called the Weasel Zone Supercar by Phantasialand, which is an amusement park in Germany, in case you ever wanted to know that. It doesn't really steer all that well. Guys, if you make cars, you gotta, you gotta make them steerable. Or is it a plane? Because it kind of more or less looks like a plane. I mean, you're sending mixed signals here. I don't know what to do with this information. Come on, let's lift up, let's, let's do something. Okay, steady, steady, steady. Ha, it flies. Uh, it handles like an angry pumpkin. Yeah, this is not really controllable, but looks dorky enough. Oh, why did you explode? It's water. Okay, good for you. This one is called a nice little plane for Weasel Zone by Pops. And it's super dorky. Look at it. I love the air intake. Looks like it's smiling. Yay, we're gonna go for a flight now. Yay. Oh, should have, should have, should should have lifted it up before. I retracted the landing gear, shouldn't I? Yeah. Okay, this one is small enough to fly for the bridge. Let's see if I can manage that. Oh, yes. Ah, so close. You guys wanted to see some dogfight, so I figured I'm gonna show the Sky Penetrator by Mitsutajo? I hope I'm saying that name right. Um, in a dogfight. Um, wait, something's warning me. So I have no idea how this one's gonna fly. Oh, look at that noose cone. Oh, yeah, wait. <laughs> I think the wasp behind me is having some problems. I see it tumbling towards the ground. Maybe we can intercept it. Okay, so how do I activate the weapon? Oh, that'll do. Oh, I got it! Yay! All enemies destroyed, you are victorious. So epic. Man, having those things right next to the cockpit, that must be loud. This little guy is called the Spark by Tom the Enderman, and um, yeah, it's the Spark. It can apparently do some cool things with the wings. Check that out. You can tilt the whole play. Ow! Okay, don't do that while it's on the ground. That's that's a bad idea. Yeah. Well, someone takes its sweet time to take off. Controlled super slowly. It's like a, like a sloth on tranquilizers. But you can do this with the wings. I'm not entirely sure why you would do that with the wings. Oh, it's like it's drunk. Oh god, ah, oh, jeez. Ah, uh, this, is, this is not working. Nope. Mm. At least it looks good. Because that's all that counts. Looking good when you explode. This is the Weasel Zone Seaplane Escort, and it's only intended to... This is the Weasel Zone Seaplane Escort. It's only supposed to land on water. If it try... Ooh. If it tries to land on ground, it will explode. I don't fully understand why it has landing gear then. You know, why, why, why do you need landing gear if you can only land on water? I feel you didn't think that through. Rockets. Yes. Shoot the water. Make the water explode. It deserves it. Oh. All good. Basically can't ruin it. <laughs> it's a submarine at the same time. That's cool. I haven't done this in forever. Ah, oh, beautiful. This plane is called the Weasel Zone MK408 Assault Carrier Ship by George. George the Plane Builder. Am I doing this right? Um, I know I can do things with the... Okay, that, that, that wasn't it. It comes with a lengthy description how to control this, which is never a good sign with me. But let's see what we can do. Just gotta, gotta balance it out a little bit. Yeah, there you go. 
nailed it. Oh, oh, don't, don't flip. Jeez, it's so loud. But it flies really well. I wonder how fast it can go. We're gonna reach the four digits. Man, I can't use the cockpit view. I'm gonna turn deaf. <laughs> what an odd explosion that was. That's a really cool design. I, I, I like using the VTOL engines. <laughs> Why did I expect that? Yeah, we're never gonna land this thing. Ah, beautiful, beautiful, N nailed it. Ah, I think I missed a mark there. I'm that absolutely gorgeous creation, love it. Oh, am I flying backwards? Oh, jeez, I should have turned those first. Ah, well. I love exploding stuff, so it's cool. So this is the Light Bomber by Jakester, and we're gonna make a fight against the Kicking Fish. Oh, where's, where's my enemy? Oh, there's Kicking Fish. Hey, buddy. Let's see what we can do. Oh, no. Stay with me. Or, or come back. No! <laughs> All enemies destroyed. You're victorious. You just crashed into him. But other than that, victorious. <laughs> this one is called Plain Weird Aircraft by Oliver Dog. And uh, yeah, it's he says it's not the best aircraft, but it somewhat works. And it's for me. Thank you so much. This looks like something that I would build, which makes me really appreciate this. I like how the butt is like lifting up from the ground there. Oh, don't, 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 don't tilt. Okay. Hey, that actually doesn't fly too bad. Look at that. It spins around. Beautiful. What a cute little plane. I love it. Of course, I have to try to land it. I have no other options. I even turned the engines off and it just goes at 300 miles per hour. Some planes are just too fast to land here. Okay, let's see if I can fly through the bridge. That's always fun. I know some of you are frustrated just how bad I am at flying, but trust me, some of these planes, they just handle really badly. Ugh. Also, you're watching a guy that calls himself Weasel. Would you fly in a plane with someone who calls himself Weasel? I wouldn't. I, I really wouldn't. Mm. You know what? I would love to land on the bridge. That'd be so cool. Feel we can't really... No, 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 no. You know what? You know what? I can, I can do this. I can do this. Just gotta... Well, never mind. I'm too fast. Too steep. 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 Yeah, I, I can't get that ass up. No, that ass is way too big. <laughs> this one is called Weasel Zone Wide Wing. Here you go, Svenpai. It flies, but it won't make it on the carrier. Are you sure? Are you sure this thing won't make it on the carrier? This one was made by Toxic Girl. And it is this, oh yes, it flies. It's, uh, it's a little bit inverted. I sometimes get confused by that. Im imagine, imagine you had a banana, right? Imagine throwing that banana against the wall and then just letting it lay there for like a week or so. And then you eat that banana. I don't know where I was going with this. God, those poor pilots. <laughs> Maybe we can make it land. Mm, no. What about landing here? Ooh, hey. Hey, oh, if that, ah, oh, if that thing would have landed, that would have been so beautiful. Ah, uh, yes, yes, wait for it, wait for it. <sighs> Don't do the flips. Come on, little plane, little plane. Okay, 500 miles per hour might have been a little bit fast. I, I, I give it that. I still believe I can land this. It's not perfect, but... Mm, Don't break! Don't break! It's all I want you to do. It's not break. Please. <sighs> yep. Yeah. Mm, yes. Whoever said you can't land with 600 miles per hour? I mean, wasn't wasn't totally wrong, but I mean, come on. Nothing broke. I got this. Maybe not the best landing, but something. This one is called Hypno Weasel, and I have no idea what I'm looking at. It looks like this plane is. Pulling some kind of wings? Oh wow, okay. That is certainly interesting. <laughs> what? What is this? What are you? Why are you? I mean, I'm certainly impressed that this works, but it looks like I'm pulling two kites behind me. I don't think the FCC would approve this. It, it can fly especially well. Maybe it's good for landing. I don't know. I mean, I'm going, I'm going pretty slow, so I might have a chance here. Up, oh, too steep. Oh, wait, never mind. <laughs> I landed it. Fantastic. Oh, don't, don't, don't you fall off. No, not, not, no, 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 no. She stay there. Come on, don't do this to me. Don't, not now. Oh, so close. I just gotta go slow enough. And jackpot. Oh no, 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 don't, don't pull it down. Just stay on there. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you land. I just realized that this was based on my 
plane in the last video. The weasel made plane. There's like nothing left for my weasel made plane. <laughs> this is the 077 Warfighter by Redstone Racer. And I don't know if it's based on a real plane. For a Warfighter, it doesn't have a whole lot of guns on it, does it now? Maybe it fights a passive aggressive war and puts post-its on other planes. 180 miles per hour. I, I hope that's slow enough. People can keep telling me that I have to go really slow if I want to land here. Uh, I think that was too fast. Still absolutely beautiful. 10 out of 10 would land again. This one is called the biggest plane. <laughs> its wingspan is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. And it flops on ground like a fish. I don't, I don't think that's healthy. I'm just waiting for the propellers to hit the ground at this point. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna be fast enough to, to, to lift up. Liberator, I think, I think there's a flaw in your design. Eh, once it's in the air, it kind of flies. But what about landing it? Yeah, I think it's a little bit too long for that. Wait, wait, maybe, maybe, no. I mean, with a wingspan that big, I should be able to easily glide onto the aircraft carrier. Might just be a little bit tricky with the wings. All right, bring it down, bring it down. Eh, lost a few wings. But other than that, here we do have the Weasel Jet Bomber by Destroyer 5713, and that thing is so friggin' loud! I can barely hear myself. Jeez, that thing is fast. Would you look at it? It's glorious. It's magnificent. And its engines protrude through the wings. I don't think they should do that. I think that's a really bad sign if that happened. You should, you should check back with the engineers. Now the question is, can I fit it through the bridge? Oh, no, wait. <laughs> I did totally not expect to go through there. That was really just luck, just luck. <laughs> well, let's see if I can push my luck. Uh, no. Uh, maybe, 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 yes, 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 yes. <laughs> I'm getting better at this. The question now is, will it land? Well, not at that speed it won't. Ow, oh, ow, oh, I forgot the landing gear. Wait, 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 can we do this? Can we actually pull us off? Oh, please, 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 no, 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 damn it. No, 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 bad angle. Wait, never mind. This is what we've been training for, man. 150 miles per hour, that might be, nope, that's not, that's too fast still. Way too fast, ah, damn it. Well, I tried. This one is based on the Weasel Mate plane and Shadow Slayer improved on it. Oh, wow. Hey, someone got fast. Okay, easy there, little plane, easy there. Yeah, I gotta say, that is quite the impressive upgrade. I can barely tilt it up or down. I can roll it, but ah, that's pretty much all I can do. <laughs> you just threw more engines onto it. Works for me. And it reaches an fairly impressive top speed of 980. That's, that's, that's good enough. I just like blowing stuff up. Well, we're gonna let the Night Fighter by Gold Galore fight against the J18 Wasp in dogfight mode and see how this little guy fares. This one is called Weasel Zone for USS Tiny by Spider, and it has some very impressive air brakes that should help me to land on the aircraft carrier over there. Nice and easy, Weasel, nice and easy. Nice and, oh, that's too easy, too easy. I know we can land a plane without completely destroying it. This is made for it. No, damn you. It is really hard to gauge how long this thing will stay up in the air. It's like a lot of experimentation right now. Air brakes. Yes, 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 100 miles per hour. No, too steep. I'm gonna land this plane. This is certainly possible. All right, air brakes. The other thing, too steep. Wait, no, no, we can't do this. Just stop, 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 stop. Don't, don't roll over. Ah, yeah, we did it. We landed the plane. Fan friggin' tastic. It's all about skill, ladies and gentlemen. It's all about skill. This one here is called the Weasel Copter by Carry Berry. And <laughs> it looks appropriately dorky. Um I assume we take off. I thought I could angle the VTOL engine here. So are you a helicopter or are you a plane? You're sending mixed signals. Okay, you're not sending anything anymore. Oh, we lifted it up, wonderful. Well, this actually flies fairly well, I gotta say. An interesting plane helicopter. Much dork, such plane. Wow, we can do this. We can pull this off. Ooh, scraped the ground, but nailed it. Ah, 
Wonderful job, Weasel. Wonderful job. <laughs> the question now is, can it land on the aircraft carrier? I hope it can. Oh, it's a little bit too fast now, isn't it? Up, oh, yep. Ooh, come on, you gotta get up. You gotta get up. You gotta get up, buddy. We gotta. Really? Come on. Come on. No, 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 no. Ow. Ah, this is looking good. No, no, I cut the engine too early. Come on, you little dork copter. Oh, too steep, too steep, too steep, too steep, too steep. Oh, never mind. Nope, I got this. I got this. I got this. I got this. Ha 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 ha. Perfect. That's a second landing this episode. Time to sleep. This little plane is made by Fango Volante. And it has some air brakes which are hooked up to the vertical takeoff and landing somehow. I, I'm not entirely sure how this works. But it has some interesting air brakes up. So close! If I use the air brakes properly, I can totally land on this thing. Third landing. Oh man. Can you can you imagine? Can you imagine? People really want me to land here. I appreciate that. And I, I will take all the help I can get. Ah, shit. Okay, time to air brake. Yes, 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 yes. Ah, no, 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 no. Mm, maybe, please. <laughs> ah, we did it. We did it. Yay! That was beautiful. Also, we know how fast the aircraft carrier is going. 15 miles per hour. We learned something. No, we didn't. This one is simply called the Weasel Zone Fighter by Bomb Bandit. And yeah, it has quite a few miniguns, I would say, and quite a few missiles. Maybe a few too many, I'm gonna say. Maybe, maybe, maybe a few too many. Then again, can you ever have enough? You know, let's see how the computer controls the plane. Yeah, I can see the computer is doing a great job so far. No, seriously, what is he doing? Well, the enemy is not far behind. Oh. Good, good job, computer. Good job. Um, what are you doing? Oh, you want to fly upside down. Sure, that, that, that makes sense. I don't think the computer knows what he's doing. That's water. Well, that's not good. Maybe we should try this again. Maybe we shouldn't. Here we have another plane from Krobyflex, which apparently has a lot of air brakes. I think I've lost something back there. That's odd. I should be able to land this on an aircraft carrier. Okay, let's see how good these air brakes are. Uh, let's throttle and let's start braking. Uh, oh, a little bit better than I expected. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, 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 yes. And nailed it. Okay, I, I, I can do better. I know that. And air brakes. Air brakes. That's too steep. Oh, I have a good feeling about this one. <laughs> I like that I'm so bad at landing that people started to make planes that I can land with. I really appreciate it. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, I think I lost a piece. I don't know what I lost. Looks good to me. I win. By the way, can I... Are these... Oh. Oh, I dropped the bombs. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not enough collisions this episode. I'm very sorry for the inconvenience. This one is called the Mesue Seagull by Dunham Aerotech, and it looks like it could be a real plane. I've been looking up the name, but I actually couldn't find a real world equivalent. But it is a very beautiful design plane with a lot of details. The cockpit view sadly is in a weird spot. I don't I don't I don't know how I'm gonna be able to fly this plane from down here. I'm I'm a little ant and I fly planes or something. I don't think those mountains should be in this position. Nope, I can see the water. That's not good. Ah, too late. Since there's so many planes uploaded every day, I'm gonna have to be a little bit more selective in the future, and these are definitely the planes that catch my interest. If they're goofy and hilarious, like the Weasel Zone Air Transport. Look at, look at it. It's flapping its wings, and it's, <laughs> it lost its engines. Oh, oh god, I'm gonna be, oh god, I'm gonna be sick. I, I don't, I don't think air brakes are gonna help here. There you go, it doesn't need to be too fast. It'll fly just fine. The plane doesn't really roll. Those in the back are a little bit too small for this. Ah, uh, but I really love the creativity that went into this one with the cockpit. What a beautiful, beautiful cockpit. This plane deserves a hero's death. Good night, sweet prince. This beauty by Auto LP is called Fast and the Fusion Fall. I, I I have no idea what that title means, but it looks like it'll be fast. Very very compact design. I can appreciate that. Oh, hey there, hey there. Quite agile that little one. That's a sporty little plane. It's so sporty. I want to eat a burger just to make up for all the calories I'm burning just by flying this thing. Oh jeez. 
Yeah, just flying for the bridge like it's nothing. Ah. Well, I was close. Not to worry, we can do this. I have a plan, which involves not hitting the bridge. I know, it's not a very complicated plan, but at least it's a plan. I don't see you coming up with a plan. <laughs> Damn it. Wait, what is that? There's a plane in the background. What? Why is there a plane in the background? Damn it, I'm hallucinating again. This little guy is called the Weasel Zone Triple Slicer. Probably because it will slice onion like it's nothing with its very unique design. So this one is called the Weasel Brothers First Plane. I assume that's a reference to the Wright Brothers, which would have been so much cooler if they would be called the Weasel Brothers. But this one supposedly controls super smooth and easy as soon as it's up in the air, but it takes it a while to get there. And it has a ton of air brakes. So I have the feeling we can land this thing anywhere. Wow, this thing really takes forever to take off. But it's so happy. Yay! Okay, let's see how the landing brakes pay off. Oh, wonderful. Wait, what, what, something broke. Oh, the propeller. And the wing fell off. Yeah. Um, nope. <laughs> it just bounced off. And then it exploded. And I lost my nose. Eh, good enough. It's on the aircraft carrier. That's all that counts. Why are we rolling backwards? Why is this happening? Don't do this. No. Whew. Close call. Here we have a jumbo jet, which is giving the word jumbo a whole nother meaning. This massive 100,000 pound beast can fly faster than 900 miles per hour and over 100,000 feet high. And yes, it can fly into a bridge. Yeah, man, that thing is so loud. Tune it down, little jumbo jet. Okay, let's do an inventory. How many friggin... Oh man, so many engines. The best part is it has air brakes. So we can totally land us on the aircraft carrier, right? Brake, brake, brake. Ah, um, nope. But it looks really good when it explodes. Can we have that in slow motion again, please? Ah, beautiful. It's so pretty. Yule logs were yesterday. Now it's exploding planes. Well, we gotta test a claim if it can't crash into a bridge. Yes, it can. Quite beautiful, so. <laughs> Where are the pieces going? Bye bye, little pieces. Well, this plane here is labeled Weasel Zone, pure stupidity. I'm not entirely sure if he means me or the plane. Considering that the plane is kind of lacking front wheels, I have, I have some ideas. Well, this one claims to have the land speed record. These planes are so loud. Uh, I think 900 miles per hour is where it's at. I don't think this counts as land record anymore when it's in the air. This little beauty by Jaco BG. It's called Wheel Zone Tiny Plane. And supposedly it can land on the aircraft carrier, but I can't seem to friggin' lift it up. Air brakes are worth jack shit if you can't lift the plane up. Urgh. Ah, you mm, son of a schnitzel. God damn you. Come on. Okay. We got this now. Landing, break, 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 break. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, so close. <laughs> and they said I couldn't land a plane. Here's a reworked version of the weasel made plane. And I kind of feel if you guys <laughs> work on planes, you should make sure that at least the pieces are not falling off. That would probably be a good start. And that it can. <laughs> that it can actually fly. I mean, it's not that I can make a flying plane. This one is Nat's first plane and it flies. This one is based off the P-51 by John Drew. This plane brings me to a topic that I wanna bring up at the end of the video. It's really important. If you guys make a plane, that's cool and I totally support it, but please don't take a plane someone else made and write, hey, Weasel Zone, check this out on it. That's really not cool. You should never take someone else's creation and sell it as your own and just putting some guns on it or changing its colors. It's not really making something yourself. Make something unique, make something you're proud of or really modify something until it's not recognizable like this little fella here, which looks rather dorky. And most of all, have fun making planes and enjoy the process because after all, this game is made to have fun. And even if your plane doesn't end up in a YouTube video, you should have fun making it regardless of anything. And maybe someone else will have fun playing it. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Weasel, I'm out, and I hope to see you around. Bye bye. Bow,
Ciao.